Hey Artland, how's it going? In today's video, I want to show you guys how to draw a cartoon tiger. Now, to start off with this, we're just going to begin with the eyes. So kind of starting right in the middle of our paper, maybe over just a little bit, I'm going to draw two circles. So I'm going to put one here, and I'm going to leave some space, and I'm going to put one right over here. Then I'm just going to add two little circles inside of each eye kind of at an angle, and then I'm just going to color the rest of it in, just so I leave those two little circles white. Now, right in between the eyes, I want to add a nose. So I'm just going to keep it really simple, and I'm just going to draw a line that goes across, and then I'm just going to draw a line that goes down, and then kind of comes back up like this. Now, I want to draw the head of our little tiger here. So I'm going to start here kind of by the nose and the eye, and I'm just going to draw a line that's going to kind of curve up, and I'm going to keep it kind of like straight across down here. So we're just going to kind of go up, over, and then kind of down like this. And then we're just going to kind of curve it across here. Then starting here, I'm just going to draw a line that just kind of goes down. And then right here, I'm just going to draw a little curved line here, and then a little curved line over on this side. And then right underneath here, I'm just going to make a little line that goes over and then up. Now, we want to make some ears for our tiger. So, I'm just going to keep it simple. I'm just going to draw a little circle shape here, and then another little circle shape right over here. Then I'm just going to add a circle in here, and another circle right inside of here. Now, to make the legs, we're just going to keep this body really simple. So I'm just going to draw a line that just goes down like this. And then I'm going to add a little line that just kind of curves around for a paw. And then I'm just going to bring it up here. Then I'm going to add a little line across like this. And then right here, draw a line that goes down and over. Kind of looks like a letter L. Then I'm just going to kind of curve it around. And I'm going to draw another little line up. Now, starting here, I'm just going to draw a line that goes out, and then it's just going to come down. I'm going to add a line that goes out and then around just to make another little paw. And then I'm just going to draw this line up. Then right here, I'm just going to draw a little line that goes straight across. Now, for the tail, I'm just going to draw a line that's just going to kind of curve up and around. And you guys can draw this however you want to. You can make yours different. And then I'm just going to redraw that shape. I'm going to try to keep it the same amount of space all the way across. And then just connect it with a curve. Mine kind of looks like a little question mark. Now, we want to add some little details onto here. So the first thing I'm going to add is I'm going to, let me get Miami out of the way. Thank you, Miami. I'm just going to draw two little curved lines right here on the feet. And then I'm going to do that to each one. And then we want to make the little tiger stripes because tigers are famous for their stripes. So just keep these really simple. I'm just going to draw some kind of big curved V shapes along the back here. And then I also want to put a few going down the legs. So I'm going to make a couple little sideways ones right here. And then I'll put a couple more on this leg here. 
And then I'm just going to draw a few little curved lines going down the tail of our tiger, just so we can make some little stripes on here. And I want to make sure that I leave this one here at the end all white, because tigers always have that white tip on the end of their tail. Then I'm just going to add a few little stripes onto the sides of our tiger's face. And then instead of just making stripes going straight down our tiger, what I'm going to do is I'm going to make two diagonal lines. And then I'm just going to kind of connect it so it looks kind of like a little triangle. And then I'm going to do the same thing up here at the top. Two diagonal lines that go out and then just connect it like a triangle. Then I'm just going to add a couple little whiskers on each side. And there you go. There is your drawing of a little cartoon tiger. I'm going to fast forward and start coloring this. Thanks for watching. Hope you guys enjoyed.